rust. On earth, it usually means old pipes, abandoned ships. But what if rust is also one of the best clues for finding alien life? On our planet, rust, iron oxide, isn't just chemistry. It can be biology. Some microbes literally eat iron. Others breathe it. These iron-metabolizing bacteria leave behind tiny mineral structures that act like biological fingerprints. A new review from scientists in Germany argues that these microbial rust makers might be one of the most powerful biosignatures for exploring Mars and the icy moons of the outer solar system. Why? Because iron is everywhere, and life on Earth has evolved countless ways to use it. These microbes create something called biogenic iron oxyhydroxides. That sounds complicated, but the result is simple. They form twisted stalks, tubes, and filament networks as they oxidize iron. These structures become mineralized, and they can last billions of years in the rock record. Unlike fragile organic molecules that radiation destroys, these iron fossils survive harsh chemistry, extreme heat, and the passage of deep time. That makes them perfect targets for planetary missions. And the best place to look? Mars. The entire planet is covered in iron oxide, literal rust. Ancient Mars had liquid water, hydrothermal systems, and plenty of iron minerals. If iron metabolizing microbes ever lived there, the minerals they left behind might still be waiting in Martian sediments right now. But Mars isn't the only candidate. Europa and Enceladus, with their subsurface oceans, could also host iron rich environments. Europa's ocean probably touches a rocky seafloor. Enceladus sprays material from its ocean into space through geysers. Future missions could literally fly through the plumes and search for biogenic iron particles. To make this work, spacecraft need instruments that can tell biological iron structures from geological ones. Subtle textures, mineral forms, and chemical signatures. If we find them, it wouldn't just prove alien life exists. It would show that the same microbial chemistry thriving on Earth also operates on other worlds. And if rust is the key, we might discover that life in the solar system is far more widespread than we ever imagined.